Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel and Happy New Year. I wanted to bring you guys something special today to close out 2018 and head into 2019 in sparkling fashion, and that is Christmas celebrations here in the South. There are two that I'm gonna share with you guys today. One is brand new, uh, this is the first year they've done it, and the other is celebrating 63 years of festivity. So. Um, a lot of memories there for me. I may be a little biased to Christmas here in the South since this has always been my home, but I hope you guys enjoy this video. Three, two, one. Yay! This first celebration we went to is in a small town called Belmont. It was incorporated in 1895 and is about 20 minutes outside of Charlotte, North Carolina, just to give you an idea of the area. This was their first annual festival of trees, so after the annual tree lighting ceremony, we all headed down to the park to view the trees. Most local businesses and schools decorated a tree for the festival. Festival of Trees, I'm showing you guys a lot of trees during the day because it was much easier to capture their ornaments, but I do have a few night shots as well because how gorgeous are Christmas tree lights at night? it for the Festival of Trees for the inaugural year. We are now going to head on over into McCaddenville, also known as Christmastown, USA. So McCaddenville was incorporated in 1881 and as I mentioned earlier in the video, they've been decorating now for 63 years. Um, there are more than 375 lit trees and over 200 wreaths attached to light poles. Um, it does attract visitors from all over the countries, but us locals can go sometimes five to ten times a year. If you live close by, it's just easy to drive through and enjoy the lights and maybe even walk and have a cup of hot chocolate with your family. Um, it is a free event. Volunteers from the community, everyone that owns the homes and whatnot, um, do decorate each year. 
Fun fact and something you guys may notice about the lights here in McCaddenville is the only tree with blue lights is this red, white, and blue tree uh, dedicated to the U.S. Armed Forces. I will leave a link down below if you're really interested in, in kind of finding out how the town started decorating and why and why they've continued, so I'll link that down below for you history buffs. Okay guys, this is really the focal point in McCaddenville. This is a small pond with a fountain and many trees around it. So when we pulled up here, we were just driving through this night, I thought I would hop out and walk the rest of the way to get you guys the best view. I know I mentioned earlier that McCaddenville holds many memories for me, so I'll share a couple with y'all. My mom, dad, and I used to live in McCaddenville, and we would walk to the other side of the pond there and take family photos. I was just looking at those the other day. Another extremely fond memory is from 1996 when I was in fifth grade and my school was featured on Good Morning America in front of one of these gorgeous trees singing Christmas carols. I actually had to take the day off from school that day because it was very cold and I was on the verge of frostbite. I hope you all enjoyed taking a trip through my little Hallmark towns. Like and subscribe if you did, and be sure to hit the bell icon to be notified anytime I upload. Also, if you're curious about how Christmastown USA got its start, be sure to visit those sites linked below to find out more about McCaddenville. I'll also have my social medias uh, linked below as well. I'm sure you guys will find pictures from both Belmont and McCaddenville from our tours through there earlier. Uh, in December. I hope you guys have a great new year and I'll see you in a few days.